All right, people, you guys can't see it real well, but what you're looking at is my front porch. This is going to be a quick tour of the house that I'm going to go ahead and sell. What you guys are looking at is the kitchen. I mean, this house is less than 700 square feet. And for those of you that are looking to purchase your first home, or you're looking to downsize. In my humble opinion, if you don't have a lot of money, a setup identical to this would be much better financially than going out here and purchasing a tiny home and then having to buy your own land and then when you buy your own land, you got to, in many cases, you're going to have to put in your own septic system for your sewage and plus a well for your water. I mean, typically, I don't do house tours like this. I don't like doing these house tours because I try to keep my, I try to keep this type of stuff private, but A, I'm getting ready to sell this house, and B, I wanted to shoot this video for educational purposes. What you guys saw a minute ago was my bathroom. This right here is one of my bedrooms. I mean, this is a two bedroom house. Got a little storage closet right here. Now this house, here's my other bedroom. Now this house is located in town. Now for security purposes, I'm not gonna let nobody know where exactly this house is located. Cause my attitude is, if anyone is interested in buying this house, then you're gonna already know where to go and you're going to already know what you need to do to purchase this house that I will be putting on the market and getting sold. So this is my bedroom that you guys just saw. And back here, this is a, this is a, well, yeah, let me show you guys a closet real quick. This is just a closet, nothing special. Just a closet. And back here is the utility room. You got a you got a hot water heater that's only a couple years old. You got a furnace that is older, but it has been very well maintained. You got washer and dryer connections. And I'll give you guys a glimpse of the backyard. 
This is the backyard. And again, for security purposes, I'm not going to show you guys what the exterior of the house looks like. I'm only going to do interior picks. And without telling you guys exactly the amount of money I paid for this house, I was able to buy this house. I mean, obviously the furniture that's in this house belongs to me because when I first bought this house, I was considering moving into this house and leaving Alabama. But to make a long story short, plans have changed a little bit. And then I thought about keeping this house and using it as, and using it as a rental. And for reasons that I have explained earlier, I will not be renting this house out. And basically, basically, I was able to buy this house for less than $40,000. I'm not going to tell you guys exactly what price I paid for this house. All I'm going to tell you is I was able to buy this house for less than $40,000. As you guys can see, this house does have working electricity. All the electric outlets work, all your lights work, all your plumbing works. The plumbing in the bathroom works as well. I just wanted to do a quick video to show you guys my little house here in Indiana, which I'm going to get ready to sell. I made this video for educational purposes. Because I normally don't do these type of videos for security reasons. So this is going to most likely be the only video that I'm going to do like this. So enjoy. Alright folks, thanks for tuning in to another episode of Andrew's Life. Everybody have a blessed one and I will see you guys on the next one.